I've been reading through this antique diary, which was written in 1917 by a 17-year-old woman named Anglesey. In the last entry I read, President Woodrow Wilson announced the U.S.'s entrance into World War I. Now we're on Monday, April 16th. School again, and I was early for one great wonder. It wasn't so bad as it might have been, but I surely hated to go back. I lunched with Virginia, and after lunch, we met Joe and Ruth Wilson at Packer, and Gertie Trail at the Duffield, and all went to the movies. They were very stupid. On the way home, we went to Mirrors. When I got home, I lay down as I'm getting an awful cold. I got up at dinner and studied and wrote letters afterward until bed. I wrote to Hunt and Lou Callender. A big box of candy came for me today from Link for my birthday and $3 from Grandmother Hewlett. Inks' 18th birthday is the next day. Down here, she lists the grades from her report card, but she also attaches her report card to the back of the diary. It lists her grades for each quarter, and currently she has a B- in English, a B in Oral English, C+, plus in Spelling, C+, plus in French, B- in German, B in History, B- in Chemistry, a B for Posture, that's a subject I would definitely get an F in, B- in Art, A in Conduct, and from December to April she was tardy 17 times and absent 16 days. If you've been following me for a while, you won't be too surprised by that number. Look out for a video tomorrow about her 18th birthday.